Hello everybody, Virtual Crusader here, and welcome to my Let's Play of Control. Uh, so this game came out last year in August, and I honestly thought this was just an Xbox exclusive, so I <laughs> basically didn't pay attention to it until recently on the PSN. I saw that this game was 30 bucks, so I was like, alright, well, let me try it. So let's get on with it shall we alright so uh... yeah subtitles new game press x while moving towards a nearby obstacle Fair warning. This is going to be weirder than usual. Mm. Trust me. Helped. You called me. So here I am. Hello? I know I shut you out sometimes. Mm. Well, I'm don't... always glad to hear from you. <laughs> well, then don't shut me it's out next time. That... I get my hopes up. It's okay. <laughs> so many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like we live in a room and there's a poster on the wall. Hmm. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. The room and the poster. The picture is something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie, what is it called? The prison movie. I mean, there's several, like Shawshank and... Cell. And the picture, it's different for each of us. It can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. Ooh. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're Ain't that today's to time? Us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes, something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? We're about to find out. Anyone here? Hmm. Looks so empty. Prohibited items reminder. Certain objects are not allowed inside the bureau. Recent incidents have necessitated an issued reminder on prohibited materials. Anything smart. <laughs> Multiple building shifts detected, containment breaches. Oh. Alright, that wasn't creepy at all. Oh, yeah. Um, who was it? Expenditures. Staffing, surveillance, data center, initiative, construction, office equipment, janitorial costs, mold removal, yeah, just cost stuff. Okay.
Uh, it's the sprint button. And uh, I have trouble sprinting sometimes with this controller. Federal Bureau of Control. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. I mean, that's technically any government. <laughs> FBI, CIA, DEA. They're everywhere and nowhere. All at once. What's this? Security order. A shark in his, although permission to, following basic protocol, shoot to kill. Good luck. First minder. Uh, okay. Read that later. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Hello? Hey, excuse me. Oh, you busy singing. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go In that way to the elevator. Elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm a janitor, by the way. You were for me. I, I can't tell if he's supposed to be no, Asian descent or... Well, and I don't know. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna. I've done enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ati the janitor Welcome to is a the oldest face house. in my book. Better than somebody with no face at all. It's, I mean, it's somebody. I don't want to think about a person with no face. That just sounds creepy in itself. <laughs> Let's go. The cell and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? Okay, so this is like the, the credits. I like how the opening credits, they're, it's ambience, there's no like, mute, like actual, like lyrical music, it really sets the tone in the world. Okay, this is getting creepy. Control. And out of the elevator Could we I go. I you there for a moment. You know huh? what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. No, I didn't, but now I do. 17 years since the men of this bureau took him. Hmm. So level one clearance, which I don't have. French, do not disturb. Barbara, I am not to be disturbed. Cancel all my appointments for the day, for the rest of the week. I can't trust them, Barbara. Not a single one. Trench. Huh. Can't trust anybody these days. Oh. Hello. Oof. Shit, shit, shit. 
<laughs> you want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? I mean... <laughs> my boy massacred himself, so... Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a live a action? very powerful one, ingrained in the Bureau's That's pretty DNA, good. a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. <laughs> That's dope. Like live action blend. Oh, look at this place. Where am I? Onwards to see your ancestors. Oh. Got it. Oh. Hello. Where are you walking? Got some candy? Oh, one hit wonder. The same gun. Take it for thy own. Okay. Now I have a gun. Ooh. Oh, hello. She's just like Uncharted. Bet. Oh. Ah. Alright. That nigga. Mm. Oh, you were hiding. spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word and this gun's alive you know what I'm happy happy to be here well I'm happy to be here too things have quieted down outside mm. is it safe to go so this is a map nope It's not creepy at all. What is that? You can't let this happen. You can't let this happen. You can't let this happen. Oh, that's a live action right there. You can't let this happen. 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 You cannot lose your mind. You stopped it. You. Thank you. 
You're, you're welcome. Was... Well, let's not have that happen, shall we? Trigger happy. Well, I still can't go in that door. Who's that? The hotline. Oh, hello. That's pretty cool how they're doing that, but I can't- Oh, right. Hmm, back up, boy. We checked out the suspected AWE in Dilith. Wasn't anything, just like the house fire before this and the malfunctioning clothes dryer before that. My team is getting pretty sick of duds. We need to find a better way to sort the fake AWEs from the real things. Or you need to rotate these field agents off a bit. Anyway, we're en route to Sherman Ranch, next one on the list. Let's hope it's a little livelier there. Sincerely, Special Agent Keenum. 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 Alright, do I go here? Oh. Hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss. Burrowing into everything in this place. Whoa. Is the hiss your enemy? Alright, it's. That's actually pretty enemy. cool. That babble's contained. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. Oh, hello. <laughs> ah! Oh! Not the way, boy. Huh. Oh, hello. Oh my god, okay. I was not expecting that. I died. I thought I could take him physically and run off, but guess not. Okay. Do I have to go in the bunker again? sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. It's time to be easier. Let's go. Take out big guy. Ah, he charged. Now take out the little guys. Hmm. I'll take you out. Thank you. Thank you. Hmm. Hmm. Back up. All right. 
right? Um, it's the control point. What does that mean? Help me fix it. So my guess, it reverts it back to its normal state, where the hiss weren't involved. Holy shit! You did it! We did it! I was about to say, we did it, because I'm you controlling through you. Are you e yes? Uh-huh. Are you still sane? Yeah. Um... Hello? I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. Yeah, I'm Pope. Emily Pope. I'm Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse uh. Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. Oh, shit. You're the new director. Hold on. We're coming out. Director, Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Hello. Look, somehow this hostile force, this hiss, that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss, like the sound of poison gas leaking in. Yeah, that's a pretty cool name, though. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone, not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. I mean, she, he blew his uh, sorry, brains I'm out, so... Too much. This whole situation is just a lot. Trench is dead. Shot. Ah. I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? I mean, I would weapon. figure. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell her about you yet. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Ugh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions, and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. Okay. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the bureau she's a part of. I mean, we just met yes. her, so we can't trust I her can that try. much. She seems friendly. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. Bet. Okay. You with me? We did it before. Push the hiss out. Is it possible? You look like you got back problems. Or she. Hello. Time to cleanse you now. Did it work? Oh, nope. has burrowed too yeah. deep. Went to dust. Out, yeah, I don't feel apart. so good. Jesse, over here. Mm. We need to 
make a plan, Jesse. I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. I mean... Maybe that's too much already. It's not too much, you just... I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an Altered World event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. Uh, well, that's a sign he's probably I dead. I knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us. A few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench. The ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun. An old Bakelite telephone. A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. So is he like alive? Where is the hotline? Or it's kept in the communications department through the mail room. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. Hmm. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. They call me the director. But that's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. I actually don't. <laughs> yes, I came for my brother, but well, there are other reasons too. Well, besides the brother, that I is. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. Uh, for now. But once we come in, clean that right up. Look, I know this is all new to you, so don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. The door to the comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. Follow the signs to the mail room. You can get to the hotline containment chamber through there. Good luck, Jesse. See you back here once you have the hotline. Thanks, Emily. All right. Well, I'm going to stop it there for now. Uh... And then we'll catch up on this in the next part. So, I mean, so far it's, it seems pretty good. I, I like it. And let's see what else is in store. But uh, stay tuned next time and uh, goodbye.